Let me just do a close up to sync it up. We will have to hold down to this. And then on our Xbox, we're gonna hold down to the syncing button. And that's about it. It's gonna sync up extremely easy. Anyways, right now we're gonna go to our Xbox and sync this up. All right, so here's our Xbox and you do need your Xbox to be turned on by the way. So it is on right here, I can see it's on. So we're just gonna hold on to the button for four seconds. Once this starts blinking very rapidly on our Xbox, we're gonna have to press this. That's to sync. We should see our Xbox like so. And it should be making that noise, which is perfect. At this point in time, it stopped blinking, both of them. So it's a steady light, which means they have officially been synced. So that's our Xbox. Here's this guy. I know it's powered on because I see some lights. I also see a light right here. So once again, this is my Xbox. Here's my headset. I do have steady lights. So that means it's all synced up. You might also notice something like this on your screen that your headset needs an update. So just go ahead with your controller, press on update headset. It's going to update right now. So it will update your headset as soon as you sync it up. That's going to be automatic. You don't really need to go into settings and look for an update. And that's it. That's all you guys have to do for this setup. Anyways, if you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.